Um, I think the big thing is you just have to trust the coaches. Uh, I don't think anybody doubts that Urban Meyer is a really good coach. Um, and he knows more about quarterback than I know. You know, I just will do my job in there. And, you know, I love both of those guys. And like I said, my, my, my favorite thing about that whole situation is there's no divide in the locker room. Um, and there's no divide between JT and Cardell. They love each other and they want each other to do well. So that's, uh, you know, whoever's the man is the man. I don't know if you've heard this yet or not, but uh, Zeke moved into like ninth place all time in the rushing, uh, mm -hmm. rushing uh, board yep. tonight, uh, over 3,000 yards. Uh, and I think he needs about 800 more to get to second all time ahead of Eddie uh, uh, this season. Uh, how much is his legacy, like uh, a point of pride for you guys, you know, blocking him, your whole, you know, your whole career, and seeing him get all that yardage? What does that do for you? I mean, you know, that's, that's kind of something I can hang my hat on. You know, obviously he makes plays. Uh, but help him make plays. Um, you know, offensive linemen don't have a ton of stats and things like that. Uh, what What is satisfying for me, and I'm sure the other guys on the line, is rushing yards and being able to protect the quarterback on passing situations. Um, and at the end of the day, wins. Um, so I think we're doing a good job uh, of all three of those, obviously, with the wins. Um, and I just, you know, hope I can get him as many yards as I can. You know, I'm just going to do my job and you know, he deserves all the praise that he gets because he's a great dude and he's a great player.